The sun has finally ended its hiatus. The flowers are blooming, and the animals at the Nashville Zoo are awaiting bigger crowds. With a bigger crowd comes a few new additions to the zoo family. We'll almost always see some new animals in the unseen new world. There'll be some new collection of fish or some rays or something that you might be able to see down there. Critter encounters, we'll almost always see some new animals in. We're planting some wallabies over there this year, which will be a nice uh, addition over there. Um, we are building a flamingo habitat which, right now, which we hope to have open later in the summer. And these flamingos will be joining more than 260 other species currently housed at the Nashville Zoo. The zoo has unique habitats, like the bamboo trail, created to envelop the visitor. They should feel a real immersion, in, immersion into the environment. They should feel like they're walking into another country when they walk into the different areas of the park. You walk into Bamboo Trail, you're going to feel like you're in a deep forest in, in, in an Asian jungle, a bamboo jungle. When you walk over to the African plains to see the elephants, you're going to feel like you're in the grasslands of Africa. The zoo's design helps visitors learn about animals within their natural habitat. When you come out with a family and uh, a, a mother and a father and their children see a family of any given animal. It gives an opportunity for that family to talk about how other living beings care for each other and how this nurturing environment really goes beyond the human race. It really envelops more than just us. It envelops the entire planet. And care is something zoo employees are very familiar with. I think what the public doesn't see is the amount of time, effort, and work that goes into that care. Um, we have uh, a, a very large team of animal care experts out here who are constantly looking at the care of these animals. The keepers and the animals develop very close bonds. They do definitely have individual personalities and so you get to know each one on an individual basis. They can become kind of like your friends and you, you go to work and you hang out with your friends. And those who work there think it's that level of commitment that sets this zoo apart. From the Nashville Zoo at Grasmere, I'm Cassidy Hodges, Vision News.